the warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. I'm Peter Drury, and here with me in the commentary box, I'm glad to report, is Jim Beglin. Well, thank you very much, Mr Drury, and hello to everyone. then who do you think this turns on Jim it has to be Sergio Aguero uh, the pocket dynamo a brilliant little player whose who squat build gives him that sharper edge in, in redirecting his movement to escape defenders he is one of the very very best yeah, hard to see past him he'll be looking to put on the show I'm certain of that Cristiano Ronaldo fires it in low it's Kroos Listen, the big names earn their reputations for precisely the reason we've just seen. They have a habit of making their presence felt, and here we are, early stages. He struck one, and he looks hungry for more. Great control, as if it was tied to his feet. Well, that has certainly made things interesting. Fernandinho. Lampard. Aguero, Fernandinho, looking up to see who wants it, he's looking unstoppable here, forward it goes, a real chance to break, Benzema knocks it towards the front, Cristiano Ronaldo, they've done it! They are in danger of disappearing out of sight. Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. Well, considering he has a bit of a, a shoot-on-sight policy, he was the one player that should have been picked up then. It was both careless and costly from where I'm sitting. Real Madrid have a couple of goals without reply. It's 2-0. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Modric goes long and forward. Benzema with the ball through. Tony Kroos. They are rampant! through butter they have done it again wonderful stuff and it was all about quick thinking and even quicker feet but you have to ask questions as to how he got through Real Madrid take a three goal lead and they are romping out of sight now the pass Intervention was very necessary. It's Bale! Well, he would surely have scored there more times than not. Now it's Benzema. Silva. And it's Aguero. towards the front line out towards the flank keeper has beaten it away and he 
could just about hear the collective sigh there. They know they got away with one. Fernandinho. Kolarov. It's gone for a throw-in. Silva got into a good position, but he may need to hold things up. Daniel Carvajal boots it upfield. Aguero. Aim forward. And it's Milner. Tony Kroos does well to read it and intercepts. Looks like a good ball through. Fernandinho. Yaya Toure. And it's Benzema. Ball through needs to be good here. Chance to shoot! He's tried one! The defence can get it clear. Lampard. And the first 45 minutes are up. Real Madrid are cruising it at half-time. 3-0 ahead. Here we go again, then. Lampard. Daniel Carvajal. James Rodriguez. Marcelo. It's a long forward pass. Tries a through ball. Marcelo. Floats one over. Lampard. Cristiano Ronaldo. Benzema! World class carry! Benzema, ruthless and relentless, utterly rampant. Devastating, I mean, that's the only word you can use to describe that. That kind of breaking power is absolutely devastating. That was fantastic to watch. Real Madrid, totally rampant here. Aguero. An hour into the second half. James Rodriguez. Modric. And it's Bale. Bale passes it through. Wasn't the greatest of balls. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Milner is making a foray down the right. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Benzema. It's Bale! Well, that was a really awkward one for the goalkeeper to deal with. Benzema. Aguero. Milner. Sergio Ramos. And it's Aguero. Milner. 
James Rodriguez pumps it forwards. Cristiano Ronaldo tries to root one option. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Benzema, timely intervention. What about it? What about that, Jim Beglin? I think when you can see the goal like that, the manager has to start questioning his personnel because to allow someone into that position, totally unmarked, I think that's reckless in the extreme, I really do. He snaffles his third, and that earns him the match ball. This is one of the best performances I've seen in a while. He's practically taken on this team single-handedly, and they don't know how to stop him. Real Madrid tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. Firmly met. Aguero. Modric has a long pass towards the front. And in time is up, and there goes the whistle. Real Madrid, very much the dominant side, almost the only side. Every time they got on the ball, they looked like scoring. It is a landslide. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? I think when we look back at that, the, the early goal proved so decisive. I think scoring when they did just gave them that element of control and confidence, and that proved key.